Hi everybody. I hope you're having a good day. Um, I'm behind in everything. I mean, it's I'm so behind in stuff. It's like funny. Um, but yesterday, well, actually, it was the night before. Yes, uh, how do you say that? Two nights ago. Yeah, I guess two nights ago. Um. A couple people I know take care of a food, uh, clothes, clothe, cloth closet at um, a church, and I do their mending. And um, they somehow lucked out and got a bunch of children's clothes. Basically, their church. Um, I don't know if it's every day or so many days a week, um, do lunch for families. Um, and, but they ended up with like three garbage sacks of clothes that needed mending. And I was cutting off tags. I mean, I could not believe these clothes. It was just like a seam was out this, you know, this much or this much. So I just went through all the clothes mended them basically everything got mended in white thread but you can't see it because it's inside um uh did have to sew some buttons on uh that were loose yeah i just went over the clothes and then i washed them folded them neatly and kept uh, it took me all day yesterday to do but I, you know i have a little washing machine so that kind of slowed me down but you know, least I could do, least I could do. Um, but I believe that, you know, charity begins with you. That, yes, charities need money, but they also need extra set of hands, um, people's time. Um, there are so many local places. Um, I can't economically donate money. So I support two online forums and pretty much will do whatever, you know, any like any of my friends say, hey, we're having this big lunch. We need, you know, an extra set of hands. I'm there. And in this case, I have always done the mending for the ladies. But boy, it's a pretty aggressive lady, so I don't know. They might have went to Target and just said, we're going to stand here till you give us clothes. But um, they weren't, they probably would be clothes that were going to charity anyway. Because, you know, of the, um, they look like seconds, you know, like, you know, when they make something, it just like the machine skipped for them. <laughs> but, um, and I suggest maybe you guys consider it. Especially if you're going through a time that is hard for you, maybe you're not quite on your game, consider helping out, you know. A guy I know shovels his neighbor's walk. It, it can be little things, but yeah, I think that just the world would be a better place if more of us would just take so any amount of time out of our you know life and you know helped out a little um now a lot of times you know people think oh i don't have that much time sometimes these people are happy if you give them one hour of your time a week um everybody's got time um i'm lucky enough like for women that are older or men um I'm lucky to have my grandchildren within driving distance and I see them all the time as you know but there are many children that do not have or are have grandparents accessible to them. There's even be a grandma and grandpa program. <laughs> so think about it and um, you know looking yeah your community has so many different programs that you probably don't even know about um 
so I'm eating my Lunchable, like always. Um, I should do yard work today. Oh, God. <laughs> it's one of those days. Oh, I should open a present from my friend. Yeah, we're still doing the box. So, let's see. What have you guys passed? Well, you missed this. She gave me some. I have my glasses on. It's Maybelline, the falsies. And it's uh, mascara. Boy, does a girl know me. Something else, because I think it's been at least two days. Um, if it was candy, forget it. You'll never see it. Um, I have scissors. That's not a good thing. Well, I'm going to pick this one to open. And she wraps them so good. I'll see you in a minute. Oh, look. She sent me a pink uh, uh, scrubby thing. What do you call these? Is that not cute? I actually could use one for um, affiliating my uh, body. For, because, you know, I dye my skin. Excellent. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Don't know anything about it. Again, I should have put my glasses on. But it's really dense. It's a really thick one. Um, yeah, let me go put on my glasses. Yes, and there's my lunch bowl. Um, just says affiliating mesh. Sponge by Studio. That's all. I love these boxes we sent to each other. No wonder she says you know, she likes hers. They're just fun. And it goes on. You know, I mean, you can choose to open them all at once. But neither of us do that. So, you know, Feels good. Um, so I'm going to go eat. Oh, I'm trying to figure out what I'm doing. I don't know. Um, I have steaks for tonight, and, oh, and I need to drink water. I'm not doing good on this water. You know, I've been thinking, well, buy limes. I love you know, limes. I don't like lemons. I, I mean, I like lemons, but I lo love lime in my water. So I may have to do that. We may be going grocery shopping. I don't know. For sure, I have to do some yard work later on, but getting close to one not the best time to be doing uh, yard work today um, so that's basically so oh and I didn't get my hat done so I'm going to try to, that for sure I want to finish my hat felt it was just more important to uh, get the clothes mended so I guess that's my thought and um, but I would ask you, please, to consider well, looking into a charitable place or a place where people need you. So I'm with Jules and we're going to Michael's. She needs frames for her instructor certificate and a really cool poster she got. And it looks like I need a neat the yarn needle, which I don't even know if one exists, but to finish a hat and maybe look for a frame for the last go gone that somehow it was in a tube and something accidentally got spilled in it. Now, I'm not saying anything, but I have a feeling it's one of my grandchildren. Uh oh. Yes. Oh, no, it had some. I'm suspicious that it was chocolate milk. Oh. Yeah. And, uh, there were, let's see, needle. Yeah, that's all. Yeah, I'm going to have to cut it down <laughs> to uh, frame it. Look at it, all these frames Jules had to choose from. She picked the right perfect one, but that's a nightmare. And there's more goes on and on and on 
Oh, we're back from Michael's. Um, I got some funny looking glasses. <laughs> they were on sale for $1.99, the reading glasses. So I got um, some checked ones. <laughs> and these are, they just have like a slight, I don't know, kind of design. And these have little rhinestones, tor no, tortoise shell. And I got some yarn needles. Really big. Would be good for my grandchildren to, to sew with. They have really big eyes. And then I bought some of these. They're just plastic bags. They were $3.99. And they are, I'm trying to find the size. I had it the right time. The right side. Um, three, three inches by two inches. And I'm going to put vitamin packs together. And I always need these little bags. And you get like a hundred for $3.99. And then some dark chocolate and sea salt caramel. Mm, mm, mm. Sounds good. And I think I spent all together like it was twenty some dollars, just just barely over twenty dollars. As you're looking at the refrigerator, um, still too hot to do yard work, so I think I'm probably. Oh, I don't know what I'm doing. I. Unloaded the dishwasher. Hmm, I'll think on it. Oh, the bags are perfect because I still have room for vitamin C. What I'm, I need these old bags for beating, so it doesn't matter. But what I'm hoping is that I make seven of them and just reuse them at the end of the week and have seven empty ones. A lot of times I think, oh, I have vitamins, but I'm running out the door. So now I can grab them, except I need to go buy a multi and some vitamin C. So, I don't know. I don't know if this will work. So I'm trying to finish this hat. So basically, I've just taken needle attached it to some yarn and I've gone under two over two and it's time to gather it so I apparently just gather away and you probably can't even see it it's getting close you know it's getting so I'll finish gathering it and then I sew it sew it and I'm done oh this this hat has been so hard it's too tight of a stitch. It's too thick. But, you know, I'm going to finish it. But I think I'm going to find another pattern. But I gathered it first on the wrong side. I'm telling you. <laughs> this has been the weirdest, weirdest, weirdest app. So anyway, I'm going to gather it. And we'll see what it looks like. Well, one hat. I think it's slouchy enough. Um, fits pretty good. Um, it's warm though. It's too warm. <laughs> I mean, it'd be good for the dead, dead of winter. But, um, one of the things I wanted was, like, I had that, um, I, mean, I don't think it looks bad. But I'm happy I finished it. I have to look closer at, like, the back of it. But it does fit well. And it's slouchy. Um, I don't know. I'll look at the camera after I film this. <laughs> Voila, one hand done. So, mm, I used a pretty lightweight yarn. So, I might try a couple other patterns. But I did want to make a hat. Made a hat. And it works. So, I wore the hat for a bit. Um, it is like 
super super warm um i like the i don't think you'll be able to see it but i like the cabling effect it has like you no know, little you know, lines that go through it um did think though because i have to make i think i have enough for two more dish rags for me and then i want to make my friend um jules um some dish rags to to go with i need because i want to give her oven mitts for christmas but i was thinking if i did double crochets i could make dish rags faster so hey i'm learning something well i'm gonna go cook dinner and probably call it a day today but um i'm always happy when you guys watch and i'm you know, trying to be really good about answering questions um again talking about charity um i you know basically i go on youtube to do stuff on monday wednesday and friday or i'll upload you know in the interim so if i you know if you ask me something on monday i'm may not answer till Wednesday and I this is like really this is really strange because I'm on a computer six days a week but Tuesday and Thursday is when I try to um you know support my boards and do stuff um and um you know then and also try to get you know that well I don't, I don't know when I go shopping. I do not have schedules to my life. It just doesn't seem to work. Everyone I've ever tried to create has just, I might as well just torn up the piece of paper. So, but take care and I'll see you guys next time.